2019. I am Demetrius, and I have some really good people with me. I have Dan, Sam, and a special guest from Marvel, Mark. Why don't you hey. say hi, Mark? Hey, how you doing? All right. Now, we're here to show Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3, The Black Order. So, uh, Dan, why don't you go ahead and just take us away on that? Yeah, thanks, Demetrius. We're going to just go jump into a stage here in just a minute, um, show some of the stories, show some of the characters. It's just such a great cast from all different groups, the Avengers, Guardian of the Galaxy, X-Men, and whatnot. We want to show some of that and uh, just show some gameplay. And, Mark, you can kind of show us uh, some of the finer points or, you know, tell us some examples of really good uh, story parts that you were involved with. So, Absolutely. Um, we're just going to jump into a state uh, level here. It's the Xavier Institute, which is uh, going to be known to comic fans as the home of the X-Men. Um, and we've got the Sentinels coming in. It's probably the house that cannot get insurance anymore. <laughs> I don't think anybody touches they have the a mansion. Tough time. Gets knocked down a lot. Yeah. <laughs> Every time I hear the like yeah. X-Men, I just want to go X-Men like really a lot. I have to like hold myself to. That. <laughs> so Mark, you being the writer on this game, it must have been so fun to have a chance to jump into this franchise where. Really, you've just got Marvel's toy box open to you. All these characters, all these cool locations. What was that like diving into this writing experience? You know, it, it was really amazing. There, there are so few places that you get to use all of these characters from all these different families of, of Marvel heroes at the same time. Um, there haven't been many games in the past other than the Marvel Ultimate Alliance series where you've gotten to bring all of these great heroes together and fight villains from all of those families of characters as well. Um, so to be able to have that whole world at my fingertips while I was writing and to be able to pick and choose lots of amazing characters from Marvel's roster was, was really something special. And I imagine it's nice with this since uh, it's been about 10 years since we had uh, one of these games. You had a good chance to do a fresh start. People don't have to have played the first two games. They can just jump in, so you could just write a really nice, solid new story. Exactly, yeah. We wanted to make it accessible to everyone, whether you're a fan of the original series or you're a, a brand new person coming into Marvel for the very first time. Speaking of jumping in, Speaking how about we get into some multiplayer? Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. We're going to jump right into multiplayer here. Oh, Sam. you want me to jump into? Yeah, yes. yes, jump on Thank in. Thank you. Um, I'm just going to start out here with Luke Cage. Um, he is super cool. Am I gonna he get is out? a I'm cool kind of character. He's kind of a big bruiser. Cage, actually. <laughs> how are you doing there, Spider Gwen? You with us? Okay, <laughs> there, we <go. laughs> there we go. There we go. We're going to come in here. Uh, all the characters have kind of light and heavy attacks, which you can combo by uh, pressing, pressing buttons. <laughs> Pressing the various yeah, X or Y corresponding. Right, X or Y. And they also have special abilities, uh, which are activated with the R button and then one of the other A, B, X, Y buttons. There we go. Nice. Yeah, that was Spider Gwen's uh, giant web ball. And I apologize, I'm just getting too busy nerding out about comics to remember, like, I yeah. have to play this, too. <laughs> yes. So why don't we again say who we're playing? Because I know, you, Dan, you said you're Luke Cage. I am Iron Man. Yep. And I'm playing as Captain Marvel. I got Gwen. Yes, there we go. So we made sure so work of those Sentinels, but there's quite a few more up here. Um, you can see Iron Man's got one of their power cores. Um, if, if you defeat them, they drop that, and then you can use it to uh, hit the other ones. But blow them up with some make additional you, damage. Make you drop it. Um, I love all these cutscenes. Yeah, the cutscenes are so great. And I like that there's just like so many different inspirations from movies and comic books and animated series that kind of play into the look and feel of these. And that was really important to us. One of the things we wanted to do was make sure that it was accessible to fans no matter where they were coming from, whether they're fans of the Marvel movies or the comic books or the old game series. We wanted to make sure that they were able to jump into this game and have all the knowledge that they needed, feel like they could relate to the characters and have that connection that's so important when you're playing a game. Oh, yeah. uh, and give each character a moment to show. Yeah, so here we have uh, Nightcrawler and Psylocke coming in. They're going to join the Alliance. We'll be able to play with them after this. But first, we've got more Sentinels to defeat. Let's get them. I have no problem with that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Send them to the scrap heap. You can see the uh, arcing line that appears between our characters. That indicates that there's some synergy between our abilities. And we can probably trigger Oops. a, oh, a special attack. Good. If we time it right. Oh, nice core throw. That was a good start. Oh, yeah. Each of the enemies has a uh, hit point meter and also a stagger gauge. Um, and when they're staggered, they kind of go down like that, and you can kind of hit them as much as you want before they get up. And then they also drop uh, items as well. It's a good way to keep them from damaging you, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah, there's another core. Yeah, I think we're going to just mop these guys up. That's what superheroes do. Yeah. <laughs> you can see uh, there's a few item drops there, too, that we're getting you're leveling up as you go, getting experience. Okay, let's see. Which core there somebody could get? Yeah, I got it. 
I'm gonna throw it off to the right here. Okay, I'll oh, come back and fight this guy. One thing I love about this game is depending on which characters you bring with you, the, the ways their different abilities synergize are so different, and each character really feels distinct. Oof. So it's just so fun to experiment and see who kind of feels like they meet your play style, who works well together. Yeah, and that was one of the considerations yeah. we really took when we were putting together the roster is not just who would make great characters for the story, but who would play well. You know, mm -hmm. we wanted to have a wide variety of powers and, and ideas behind these characters so that everyone could find somebody that they love. Yeah. And it's really great how like the synergy moves sometimes mirror what you see in the movies or comics. So there's a there's a move between Captain America and Iron Man where he can kind of bounce his repulsor ray off of uh, Captain America's shield, which is straight Super from cool. the show. Yeah, there's all kinds of great combos. There's a uh, you, you can electrify one of uh, Storm's tornadoes with Thor's yeah. hammer. That one's a lot of fun. Yeah, oh, I didn't make you do that. That's yeah. cool. Yeah. I had to try that. <laughs> yeah, there's elemental attributes that can be added due to synergy, so it's it's really nice. So after we beat those guys, we're going to have these two join us. Um, and we can go ahead and switch characters if we want, yeah. try out yes, some of the guys. Please. There's so many I definitely want to go through and try out a bunch of them. Uh, so let's go to Hero Select. OK. OK. Now, who's, are we coming dibs, or are we just going <laughs> to? Oh, I don't know who <laughs> yeah, I want should... next. Let me see. I would like to play as Iron Fist. At least I, hope mm, nice. I might grab Wolverine, actually. Yeah, I got Ms. Marvel. I think I'm going to try the Hulk. You know what? So press B when you're ready with your selection. I'm trying to decide. Yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> when now. you're a fan of all these characters, it's hard okay. It's hard to decide. It is. Oh, yeah, yeah. It absolutely and is. And you can see there's so many, like, the Inhumans are in there. Uh, just all kinds of different groups that haven't been represented much in games before. I think a lot of us, too, like we were saying, a lot of us, we're back home, you know, in the office. We're still big comic book fans at heart. So <laughs> this type of game oh, for yeah. us is just, like, really, really fun. I can't wait to actually play this with you guys in the office. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you can kind of make your dream team. You know, all those characters that might not team up every day in the comics or in the movies, you can oh. finally bring them together. Hulk got shocked. <laughs> he wasn't talking very well. It's so interesting, oh, the no, dynamic between the characters and what you get to see as far as see, there was I mean, even characters that maybe don't meet each other all the time. It's got to be really cool to get a chance to write those interactions and write those meetings. Yeah, we tried to find different, unique interactions that necessarily wouldn't be found in the comics all the time and, and just give these characters a, a moment to highlight their relationships. There are a lot of characters who have deep history together, and trying to fit that into the game was a lot of fun. Yeah. Speaking of somebody who's oh, fit who's into in the there? game over here. <laughs> you can see through <laughs> the window <laughs> cooking tacos in there. <laughs> It's Taco Tuesday, right? It's it Tuesday. <laughs> no, Hopefully they'll have some tacos over there at the uh, cafeteria. Can we go out for tacos after this? <laughs> <laughs> uh, so Nick Fury is telling us to search the area, and over here we see an infinity rift. These are uh, lead to things called infinity trials, which are kind of side missions. Um, we're not going to go into those in this segment, but uh, we are going to talk about them in our next segment. So we're just going to pass over that for now. Uh, there was a message earlier that we might have missed in all the action uh, to meet the beast behind uh, the mansion, and he's going to be over here by the Blackbird. There's my ride. <laughs> yeah. What you Exiting got in us? style. What you got for us, beast? I, I do love every one of these little under the, the name introductions. They're very appropriate. <laughs> yeah, we yeah. wanted we wanted to give everybody a, uh, an intro where they were kind of summed up in a quick phrase in a fun, you know, catchy way that you could get to the core of the character at the moment he was introduced or she was introduced. And and so we we put those in and and they seem to be uh, going over quite well. Yeah. So um, here's another chance to switch characters if we want. Yeah. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> um, hmm. Okay. So did you have any characters you were particularly fond of that you found were especially fun to write for? I did. Um, I thought that uh, Ms. Marvel was a lot of fun. That was a character that I hadn't had much chance to write before. And, and so getting to, getting to explore her voice a little bit was fun because she's a real uh, new, positive, up-and-coming Marvel character that a lot of people really love. And, and I really enjoyed what character that was announced this morning, Elsa Bloodstone. Mm. Um, she is a, a British monster hunter who is all the saucy. <laughs> and, and she was she was great, uh, and then I love writing Star Lord and uh, Rocket. Anytime I can get those two together in a scene, uh, they they steal the show from me. So Some quality I, Sparmy yeah. banter. Yeah, oh my god, <laughs> so much fun. So we're gonna talk to Beast again. Um, he took that Infinity Stone from the Hellfire Club, I've who I think we know has some powerful friends. Yeah. Collection. Um, he's keep hope alive. My all right, what's going on? So I think someone's a little angry about it. Man. And there goes another Blackbird. Again, like the mansion, um, we can right. repair that. They've Pretty got sure. a whole hangar full of them, luckily. <laughs> Just the spares. Bring out the next one. Oh, my goodness. 
And this uh -oh. can't be good. That is a much larger Sentinel. <laughs> And he has one of the Infinity Stones. So the Infinity Stones are in anyway. this game, but that's it's a fine. completely <laughs> unique story from any other uh, game. It's unique for this game, so that's kind of cool. And that was really important to us as well. Yeah. We wanted to make sure that we weren't just rehashing a story that had already been told. Yep. And it's almost impossible with this group of characters yeah. to do that because even if you tried to follow the track of Infinity War Endgame, you're adding the X-Men to it, you're adding the Defenders to it, and you yep. wouldn't be doing them justice by just shooing them horn it, shoehorning them into an existing story. Yeah. Uh, so we wanted to create something new and fresh that everyone could enjoy for the first time. Oh. All right. Hey guys, so cool. Colossus guys. and Cyclops are going to help us out. All okay. Right. So now we okay. got to try to take out these enemies, and then I. Uh, so what do we get? I What's picked Psy here? Psylocke. Ooh. Not Ow. getting hit. Deal. Okay. <laughs> Strat one. Don't get hit. I am just going to do the best I can. I picked Captain America, so I'm going to brave everything. <laughs> one thing we could also do here is the. I think we have our ultimate alliance meters. Uh, Set oh, up so we can do these. Oh, yeah. Just press L and R. We can do a whole bunch of damage here in this an Alliance Extreme. You can see we're just racking up the damage there on him, which is nice. Let's take down this other sense on the um, right. And we've almost got his stagger gauge. Oh, get down out of there, too. get out of there, get out of there. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> there he goes. Okay, so let's help pilot right, on good. the big guy. Use Coming your abilities, over. we can get some synergies going. Alright. Yeah. Well done. All right. I yeah, we got down half. Somewhere. I'm gonna try to go pick it up. Is that it? Right there. Yeah. It you got it. Yeah. Get the core. There we oh, go. Oh no 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 no. <laughs> try to get out of there. I'm gonna take I'm gonna out some of these the glass areas for a second. Here when I can. Yeah, the small ones. It's good to get them, and then you can get more cores. Leap of force authorized. You think? Nope. 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 Ah. Ow. I'm just gonna hit his foot. I'm gonna get these little guys <laughs> out of the way. <laughs> You can see where they're right, dropping yeah, these items that are going to help us uh, power up our characters. I see another one. Uh, pick it up. Yeah, throw that core at him. There we go. go. Yeah, he's gone. Nice. Those Infinity really Stones aren't that powerful. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, a Sentinel just doesn't know how to use them. Hopefully they're they don't fall into the wrong hands. <laughs> That's not compute. They're no match for our teamwork. I That's right. right. <laughs> this isn't our first Sentinel rodeo. <laughs> Oh, that's a lot of mutants. There's all the mutants. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, well. That seems like a poor design for <laughs> Something's <laughs> taking them apart, and the parts are floating. Not the power stone. Come now, Cyclops. <laughs> oh, boy. When has following you ever done our kind any good? It's another thing that's awesome about this game. You never know who's going to show up next. Yeah. It's just always this really cool surprise, like, uh, are they going to join me? Are they not? What's going on? <laughs> yeah. There's so many uh, villains and, and uh, heroes. Yeah, and this morning in the direct, we got to show a lot more of the villains, yeah. which was yeah. really fun. Yeah. Modok and, and Hela and Surtur and the Destroyer yes. and Doc Ock. So yes. the, the roster of villains is growing too, which is exciting. Yeah, and the cool thing I like about the villains um, is just that each one sort of has their own way to defeat them, mm -hmm. I, I'll, I'll say, without giving away too much. Yeah, the choices on the costume design are really interesting, too, looking at some of those classic characters and yeah. some of the ones we have who are newer. We've got a real interesting mix. If you've maybe seen the character in one context, you might not recognize some of these older costumes right. or things that maybe didn't show up in the movies, but it's a really just cool walk down memory lane for a Marvel fan. Yeah, yeah it's, it's kind of a synthesis of, of all of those different mediums that they've appeared in. You know, we wanted to kind of distill them down to their core and, and make sure that, that we had the best possible version of each character that everyone would, would enjoy and recognize. <laughs> Here's Colossus meeting with Magneto. <laughs> it's a bad Seems team. like it happens all the time. Oh, and there they go. They'll be fine. Uh, <laughs> I feel like one of them will be fine. The other one's kind of fleshy, meaty bones. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'm a little worried about Cyclops. Colossus stands a better chance of, of a safe landing. He's got a hard no. head. As long as he lands on that, I'll be OK. <laughs> this is why I think if I was ever a mutant, I'd probably be a bad guy, because I would just want to talk trash and throw people around. <laughs> you want to monologue? Like, like more yeah. person, but <laughs> they get to say the coolest stuff. <laughs> All right, so let's see if we can't convince the Magneto oh. to uh, join the Alliance. Um, he's with Juggernaut and Mystique, which is going to make it um, probably pretty Very difficult hard. where we're at right now. I'm going to convince you with my fists But we can, and we my can practice. There we go. There we oh, we stunned him. Really good. Nice. Oh, get a movie. You better shake up. All right, we're getting there. Oh, no. no. Well, there's no way to beat him right now, but that may change when we get more powerful. This is clearly apparent right there. <laughs> <laughs> We're not convincing enough. 
So now it's going to roll walks as all that they hold dear crumbles to the ground. Oh, Leave not the, the mansion, mansion alone. <laughs> See what I mean? Like, like, he says the coolest stuff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. yeah. Villains have all the good lines. <laughs> Juggernaut. Nothing can stop him. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. It's almost like he wrote that. <laughs> So here's kind of a going to be a challenging part where we need to run from the juggernaut through this debris field of the mansion. Um, and Wolverine, short. Uh -oh. No, it's slow. Come on, buddy. Run, 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 run. Quick. Keep jumping. Oh, I think Sarlacc's down. It's up to you, Cap. Oh, no, I'm, I'm out. Oh, gosh. Cap, get oh, closer. No, no. Oh, no. Oh. Did he get me? Oh, he got me. Oh. No. <laughs> what? Well, this is somewhere where maybe happened. if we'd uh, chosen a more agile character. So, yeah, why don't, we, why don't we go back right. to a shield point uh, and we'll, uh, we'll pick some characters who might out here. be better at uh, fleeing from... Splatted me into the wall. Yeah, it's such a large roster. Luckily, there's a character yeah. for every situation. <laughs> and actually, the mobility side of it's really interesting because some of the characters can fly, some of them are web slingers. Yep. And it actually really changes your mobility, mm -hmm. even as far as who has a double jump, who doesn't what they do when they're up in the air, but that kind of flexibility is something that's really useful to keep okay, in mind yeah. when you're thinking about a moment like that. Absolutely. All right, so let's go in here and All switch right. to some more mobile characters. Okay. And then I will switch to Thor, because Thor can fly. Yeah, so Thor's Thor is a good choice. Uh, the spider characters are good. I got Miles. Oh, oh, this yeah, is ready for action. All right. All right, everybody, press B. Venom. We'll, we'll give this another try. We can do it. Honestly, this guy's just my boy anyway. I want to see him. Oh, yeah, action. Venom's awesome. We're getting lots of team bonuses, too. That's cool. Excellent. Yeah. All right, let's go back to the... The team of snappy dressers. All right, we'll just talk to, him, talk to Beast again to trigger... Oh, we may have to uh, lose to Magneto again. Oh, we can take him. <laughs> <laughs> we got some this time we got stronger so we characters. Right. We got this. Oh, we can... Can we skip this? Yeah, we can skip it. Okay. So, Mark, I know you've been uh, writing Marvel comics for years, and you've had a chance to work with a lot of these franchises. Before that, you were actually a Marvel editor as well. Oh, I was. I imagine that that skill set really comes into play when you're trying to manage such a large project and such a large roster. It does. You know, having that ability to balance where everybody is in the story at the same time was something we needed to do in editorial a lot because we'd be overseeing 10, 15 books a, a month. And uh, where and is have everybody to know right in now? an Avengers title where Captain America and Thor were going to be that month in their own books. Um, so being able to take all of these characters and keep a constant eye on them while I was uh, putting together this story, it was very helpful to have that background. There we go. Sorry, I'm so focused on meeting this guy. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we got to get... Oh, we staggered him already. Good. We got a lot of synergies going on. Okay, good. Come on, Zimbia. There we go. Let me get in here. All right, should we take these uh, smaller Sentinels out first? Yeah, yeah. let's get rid of them. Get their cores. Yeah, yeah that'll really yeah. help. There's one. I see a core. Yeah. Oh, no. Oof. Ow. Swing out of here for a little bit. Okay. All right. There we go. Get this other guy. Jump in the air. Oh. Oh, Thor down. <laughs> what? <laughs> Thor down. I got bombed on. I got gotcha. you. My bad. All right, then. <laughs> Venom and cares. There okay, we go. We're back. Good. We're back. We're back. Look out for the surrounding fire there. Oh, get out of there. Okay. So now we're good. Ooh. Okay. Let's get back in there. Oh, right, I think got we got him. Let's do the ultimate alliance. Yeah. Got it. Look at all that damage. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> all right. I think that he won't like that. All right. There we go. A lot quicker. Everybody level <laughs> up, too. We now got we rare just items. Deal with it was worth it. All right, let's we get more this. experience points. Let's yeah. get back to where we were. Yeah. We got this. Skip some cinemas. Okay. All right. Try to persuade you. We already know it's going to happen. It's all right. <laughs> if we can just jump right in there. Right. Come on. Should we try and see if we can take down Jonathan? Oh, it's fun. Oh, okay. You can see uh, Mystique throws out these explosive uh, grenades that are trouble. Almost. So oh. The characters all have a good variety of attack patterns, and I love how that captures, you know, the same kind of things that they would do in the actual comics. Aww. Oh, we All right, skip. At a school. All right, yep. 
skip that. Okay. All right, we can do this. <laughs> this Here we go. Terrible. We got this, guys. Juggernaut, take two. I think he just kind of took us by surprise, even though we've done this before. <laughs> Swing out of here. <laughs> Bye, watch guys. out for chandeliers, though. Oh, no, I got stuck in the chandelier. Watch out for chandeliers. <laughs> he has, like, a shockwave in front of him, too, that you have to watch oh, out man. for. He is just getting us. Come on, uh, you guys got, got it. it. I got it. Uh, keep going, keep going. <laughs> All right, so here's the payoff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. is no joke. <laughs> We're just in time for tacos. Practice That's this out loud. Right 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 right. Taka song is working. Yes. <laughs> so I, in the mirror, I sang that many mornings. <laughs> Your family just like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> okay, that's it. Someone's yeah. about to get a kick square in the chimney chuck. <laughs> Wade's got to be fun to write for. He was. He was. <laughs> oh, and then why? The mansion didn't do it. <laughs> <laughs> More patchwork. <laughs> Oh, All right. I will destroy you. Oh, okay. I well, think the, the nice thing about doubt. The nice thing about Deadpool <laughs> is that uh, he he didn't seem to care that the X Men's mansion was getting attacked by Sentinels or by no, Magneto. No, but when somebody ruined his tacos, priorities. he's joining the fight. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do we want to switch characters again? Yeah, yeah. I think I, I want to stay, yeah. stay sure. with Captain Marvel, but. Oh, we could stick with these then for a little bit. We didn't spend too much time I think I'm going to switch out to somebody with a little bit of more brute strength. Yeah, I know I'll Juggernaut's coming up. Yeah, I'll stick mm -hmm. with Thor then. I might stick with my boy here. Uh, he makes me happy. Ready. All right, we're ready. Yeah, we're ready. Drax. Drax. Who wants pizza? I'll take pizza. <laughs> <laughs> we, we got pizza? <laughs> <laughs> I thought we were well, the tacos are ruined. So we got to <laughs> order something. <laughs> all right, so we got to go to uh, chase Deadpool and Juggernaut. <laughs> And I don't. Oh, we're gonna talk much about this, or are we just gonna? Uh, we're let just folks gonna pass it. But that's a little uh, box that's kind of locked behind a force field that oh, you need special abilities to unlock. We're gonna leave that to players to figure out. It's a secret. <laughs> 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 All right. Okay. Rematch with Juggernaut. We got this. All right. No, get out of the way. Yeah, when he's charging nope, like nope. that. Yeah. There you go. There we go. All right. Pile it on now. Yeah. Oh. One thing I do love about this game is, honestly, no matter who you play, you just get to feel so awesome just throwing these abilities around and playing as your favorite characters. It's it's just a blast. Yeah, and with each of each of the characters having four different abilities, you can always switch it up while you're playing. It's just a lot of fun to to try out their different attributes. We're stunning him. We got it. He's not having a a good day. Oh, I think he, is he about to charge again? Yeah. No. Uh-uh. There he goes. Fly in the air. Gosh. Web is so awesome. Okay. There we go. Come here, Pile you. it on. Yeah, oh, yeah. Thor, I like that simultaneous Thor and Captain Marvel just descending from the sky. Got first oh, punch. we will try. Oh, we are trying. Uh-oh. Without punch again. Nope, nope, nope. Don't have Oh, so close. Oh, yeah. There we go. Ooh. We got him. Almost. Almost. Uh oh. No, no, no. Oh, that's on all three of you. I was too. I'm good. I was too overconfident. Oh, I'm trying. I'm trying. Oh, no, no, no. No, we can do this. I'm, I'm swing down. Swing around, Venom. Swing. Uh -huh. Just revive us. Oh, you're now. Okay, you're I'm only coming, hope, I'm coming, Venom. Recovery service on route. Don't, you got this. Do you not got this. touch me until I've got them up. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna try to get Drax over here if you can get him up. I got Captain Marvel. Oh, yeah. Good. Thank you. Oh. I'm healing here. What are you doing? That was he's rude. There. Now I'm out. Okay. Man. <laughs> oh, he's so tough. So yep. good though. Take him out. Almost there. We almost got him. Oh, there we go. Nice. Got him. Nice. Good job, guys. We did it. We stopped the unstoppable juggernaut. Thor is mightier. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, Cyclops, Cyclops is back. Yeah, he survived. Fine. Looks relatively he's unbruised. Fine. Oh, can you bring us back, <laughs> guys? No, nope, we're out. <laughs> oh, <laughs> gonna leave us we're he's running after us. <laughs> you think you cannot be stopped, Tovarish? This is a classic battle. 
We'll what? let them do their thing. We'll we'll see them later. Oh, and now they're right. right. finally. Gotta avenge Taco Tuesday properly. All right. Okay. Are we okay with these characters? We want to switch yeah. one more time. Let's switch them up, maybe. All right. Sure thing. Go into the hero select. Yeah. Come on. All right. All right. Who are you guys thinking? I will be. Oh gosh, so many good characters. Um. Ah, uh, I might actually grab Deadpool. Yeah, I was gonna say someone should grab. Uh, do Rocket and Groot. Oh, that's a good idea. All right, I'll be Star Lord. Uh, Wolverine. You are the best. You got it. <laughs> Rocket and Groot are really interesting too because their attack combinations are really unusual. I think since there's actually yeah. two characters right. in one. Right. Yeah. There. So Rocket does the bombs and the guns, and Groot's got his his arms and his right. his vines to attack with. So they get to have a lot of interesting combinations while they fight. Oh, no. We're into a secure location. Also, Wolverine's interesting because one of his abilities is regeneration. So not all the abilities are necessarily attack abilities. Right. Some of them are kind of more supportive or defensive. Hey, Cyclops saved us. Oh, oh no. <laughs> I thought he was fine, but Cyclops, apparently no. not. <laughs> he's still in the forest somewhere yeah. trying to find he's his way tree. home. He, he's on break. He's on break. <laughs> <laughs> and the secure location is the danger room. I don't know why we fell for that one. <laughs> all right. Okay, here we go. Survive danger room. Deal. Let's do this. Okay. So here we go. Here. The cool thing so about really the danger room is it can generate any environment. So it looks like we've got background here, maybe from Wakanda, uh, but we've got prisoners from the raft that we're fighting. So it's a mix and match of different elements from different parts. And I think uh, throughout the game, as you're playing, learning the different tells of different kind of enemies every time you encounter a new. Either type of minion or type of boss character, you really want to start paying attention to what they're doing so you can start learning those tells. Yeah, absolutely. And you can see those synergy lines are just popping up all over the place because this team, I think, has a lot of great <laughs> synergies. I love how you can just kind of with Wolverine, you can just kind of juggle these guys across the screen. I get a little carried away here. <laughs> nice. Oh, yes. Oh, I'm in. Why not? I'm on it. <laughs> Mess them up. Avoid speed. That sounds powerful. Oh, we've got another way. Okay. So we're not, I don't think we're going to be able to get through all of this, but. We can um, keep Shadow Lane. <laughs> we can. Uh, Should we do a little bit more? Yeah, we can more? do a little bit more. Okay. Right. Oh, planning a Star Lord is so fun. It's got some really cool, like, air combos. I just keep doing this all day. All right, get him with. Fire Tornado. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, see, nice. there's a plane <laughs> added a plane element to oh. a yeah. whirlwind attack. Does anybody got uh, Rocket and Groot? Oh, trying to, but these guys won't stop punching me. Oh, that's me. because you're knocked out. Or Groot is knocked Groot's out. Groot's knocked out. I'm trying to get him here, but these guys oh, will back off. All right, Wolverine, get in there. I, oh, man, stop punching me. Yeah, punching <laughs> I'm trying to be helpful. All right, here we go. Wolverine is just so fast, he just goes across the screen. <laughs> like, oh, buddy, thanks yeah. for trying. Oh, I'm, I'm going to do this. One way or another, you... Oh, there we yeah, go. Yeah, okay, yeah. we're back. I got knocked down. I got oh, you. Boy. Oh, they hit with the bomb. Me too. Wait. Okay. Almost done. That was the All same right, bomb that did me in. So. <laughs> These guys are jerks. Ah. All right. I oh. think that might be close. Or oh, we got we got a little time. Oh, yeah. Whoa. We got a few.